Get ready to bang. Isaiah is here to party. Actually a great basketball player. He would be, he's eight foot tall at 15. And he's played, <laughs> he's played a lot of rep basketball in his time. And now he's here to kick people in the head. Yeah. Oh, 15, in our blue 16, corner, this same. man here weighed in at <laughs> 62.2 kgs. This is his debut Muay Thai fight. He fights under Dave Torrens from Conungra Muay Thai in Queensland. Guys, put your hands together for Lachlan, Lachness McGrady! And in our red corner, his opponent, he weighed in at 64.6 kgs. This is also his debut fight. He trains under Micah Taylor from Taylor Moy, Taylor Made Muay Thai. He is Isaiah the Flamingo, Papa Vasilio. I already know Isaiah can fight, just due to the fact that his mum's hot. Fighters, uh, please seal the ring. I don't know his mother. His mum's a stunner. You'll, you'll walk through the crowd and you'll see her and you'll know who she is. She's over there, blonde hair bird. Okay, there you go. So, Lisa, how you doing? <laughs> Always makes her a good fighter, yeah? Oh, does. Got to fight creeps like myself off. <laughs> he was a bit of a naughty boy at school and just turned everything around by his mum, the, his hot mother that you are speaking about. Yep. Uh, sent him to Micah Taylor at Taylor Made and said, you're going to train Muay Thai. And he's turned everything around. His grades have improved. He's just really come into his own. So love a good transformation story and... Good on him. Well, if you're normally a naturally a naughty kid, you go hang out with the people that were naturally naughty kids but change their life around. And let's face it, Mick has got a head on him that you know just says, I was a naughty kid. Yeah, good on him. God <laughs> bless him. <laughs> Seen better looking heads over piss drop from that bloke. <laughs> Seconds down from the first round. Mm, they're just confirming the rules and the no elbows, which... No elbows? With elbow pads. Well, lucky they got those elbow pads on there. Mm. Lachlan out of the blue corner says that his reason for fighting is he loves doing the things that others don't want to do. Is he actually Scottish? I think he is a wee bit. <laughs> Aye. Aye. <laughs> well, I'd just say that's his reason for fighting. He's, Mate, just he's got, got a lot of relatives there. It's in the blood. <laughs> Round one. He's got it written all over him. He's going in stronger. Some good techniques being thrown by these boys already. It is. Yeah. I like how he's working his way in. Well, I was told that this is Lachlan's first tie fight, but he's had some amateur boxing bouts before. So I'm expecting to see some some nice crisp hands from the young blood. Well, I do like how he's working his way in. I like oh, nice little head kick there from Isaiah. Little foot slap across the cheek. Hello, good morning. He's finding a home for it. Oh, and those Toad. knees. The flamingo. Now I see why he is called that as he gallops around beautifully, flicking those head kicks up. No elbows, but we'll throw spin and backhands. <laughs> A little bit of the naughty boy nature is still in him. That's all right. You, you got 
Got to be a sug. Now that's a legal shot anyway. WMC rules. The whole body's a target. Give him a count. Except for the testicles. No, nah, there's still in legal theory, shots okay, in WBC. WMC, even shots to the back of the head are still classed as a target. Do I agree? No, because we're humans. This isn't blood sport, but it's still a legal shot. A little bit of the inside leg kick to the oh, testicle. Look. That's it. Um, you know, some people say I'm a bit of a sub. But, you know, I say I just fight to the rules. Isaiah finding a home with them leg kicks and now the knees. Love that he's tripling them up too. Yeah. If it's landing, why it's not throwing it? Trying to bring that guard down so he can go back up to the head. Oh, beautiful oh. overhead right from the Scotsman. Isaiah's got that bro head on him, though. It's going to take a bit more than that to knock him. But the Scotsman does. Look, he's confident. Wow, he's yeah. angry. Oh, oh wow. what a first Let the aggression out. out. <laughs> <laughs> he's he definitely wants to put on a show for everyone. Over in Scotland watching, a big hi to his family. So the ruling with the low blows uh, in WMC, the whole body is actually classed as a target and a point will be scored every time it hits. And even with the low blows, e.g. the box shots and that, they're still classed. They just have to be technically downward shots with um, a lot of them. So like you can't soccer boot up so to speak it's got to be a teats sort of down gotcha. gotcha but um but if you are going in for a clinch and you drop your head and they drop an elbow on the back of your head it's technically a legal shot in wmc okay round two fight to the rules and you should find a home for it isaiah finding a home with his long reach he's really mixing up the levels well too and which i like to see lachlan just finding a home with that Shark-like mentality of just do not move back. Ta oh. Go forward, throw heavy. And those big looping punches going to the body, then back up to the head. I like it. He's, he's just going to rely on a lot of boxing here, I feel, to um, find that spot. Which is a good strategy. He doesn't want to be on the end of those long kicks of Isaiah. Isaiah playing the smart game, going for the clinch. Isaiah using good range on them legs. I'm such a fan. But goes back to just Micah Taylor, I think, just being that long rangey fighter that he was as well. Swing and a miss with the spinning back fist, and again, just swings by. I felt the wind of it. I think the, the two misses are just due to the fact that he's used to throwing it at Micah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not boys that are two foot tall. Isaiah's playing the smart good game hands, of good hands. keeping his hands up, but he's exposing that body, just gonna drain that oxygen tank. He's digging into that body well. Lockie's going on them body hunts. Now he's coming back upstairs. Again, it's a good strategy. Attack that body, open up. Lockie got that angry Scotsman mentality. Yeah, he's working at a good range. He's not on the Final end of those 10 kicks. seconds. Now, but a chop away into that body. Isaiah is in some trouble. Lockie, like a shark in the water, can smell some blood. This fight is proudly sponsored by Punish Fight Gear and Nutrition. Some of the best gear in the world, and you can even ask a John Nugget about that. He will stand by that. Hey, I've, I've still got some Punish gear that I've used for the last seven years, you know, and it still works. It's good quality stuff. Yeah. I'm a fan of it. Worth its weight in gold. Third and final round. 
Great back in to chopping away at the body here from Lachlan. Well, you know they say little axe chops big tree. Oh, he's coming back upstairs. Lachlan's up trying him. Caught him a bit with that left hook. Oh, oh he's working a treat here. Back to the body. He's definitely taking the wind out of Isaiah a bit. Isaiah just trying to find that reach and that range again. But being a bit tired, he's um, missing it. He doesn't want to let, let Lachlan in that close. He wants to get him back out on the end of those nice long kicks. You're going to be that close, tie up. Lockie definitely just means business with big hands. Great work to the body. Isaiah's going to want to throw something oh, back here. Really, he's hurting him into the body. He's getting eight. Yeah, tie up. Smart option. Straight back in on him. It's both, a workhorse. Both boys have got the heart of Farlap here. One wants the win. The other just wants the oxygen. Big knee there from Isaiah. Lockie just takes it and walks forward straight back in again. Lachlan with the head movement that we're requesting to see earlier tonight. Yep. Little warning seconds. almost to the back of the head. Ah, it's a legal oh. shot though. Learn your rules, Matty. Here we go, <laughs> there we go. Back into the body. He's chopping away again. Good advice out to tie him up. And a round That's number three. Wow, what a absolute Great fight. cracker of a fight. Great fight. You're gonna have to give that one to the Scotsman. Well, round one, 10-8 to Isaiah. Yep. Then do you go 10-9, 10-9 to ten nine, Blue? So okay, we're calling a draw? On the unofficial scorecards, i definitely give those last two 10-9, 10-9. And yeah, I'll tell you, then, with the standing eight. Yeah. Yeah, the, uh, so you got the standing eight, the first one, 10-8 automatically to red corner. And then unofficially, it comes down to the big power shots. And 10-9, 10-9, we might be looking at a draw. Great performance from both boys. Couldn't be throwing power shots that and still be standing unless you're wearing punished fight gear and nutrition equipment. Hey, they, they make some excellent gear. I remember when they bought out the a wetsuit uh, material rashy that had some elbow pads in it. And Nick Nick gave Carnage and I one when they first came out. And I was like, these are great. Let's, let's spar. Carnage was like, really? What, you want to spar me? And I'm like, yeah. We were sparring every day of the week. But then Why we were able to spar with the elbows, and it was uh, quite the experience. Ended up with eggs all over my head. Just waiting for the judge's final decision. <laughs> guys, let's give a round of applause for those guys. That was an amazing effort. That's our first fight. First fight. Wow. Really good effort, you guys. We'll have a decision any second now. <laughs> that fight was sponsored, you guys, by Victory Pro Content. Judges have made their decision. All right. All right. So your winner tonight for this fight, it's a split point decision, and it goes to the blue corner. Lachlan McGuddy. Split point decision there to young Lachlan McGrady. Fighting out of Scotland. There you go. His promise of a gift to his mum and sister and family 
all watching in Scotland. He has delivered and delivered very well on it.